Hello, I'm David. Hi, I'm Julie. So now we're going to do a how to play and play through of Draftosaurus's aerial show, which is an expansion to the core game, uh, Draftosaurus. So if you want to see a how to play and play through of the core game, that's where I go over the rules for that. And we also did a video on the expansion, the uh, Marina expansion, which you can also check out. Now you can play with both expansions, uh, but we're only going to be doing a playthrough of this expansion. So you'll see it comes with a board that goes at the top. Now there are two sides to the board. So there are slight differences because you'll see that there is a spot here that if you place pterodactyls on this spot, every uh, is that a stegosaurus, it'll be so, worth yeah. one point. Yeah, green will be worth one. Every orange worth one. The ones that we have is that my triceratops will be worth one additional point, and Julia's brontosaurus will be worth one additional point. So when you talk about setup here, now they also had to revise these rules as well. So this is out of date, the original rule book. And what's missing from there is there is a difference in the setup and it also includes rules and how to play with both expansions, which by the way, needs to be updated as well. <laughs> this isn't, this is, <laughs> there's, I think there's a problem with this as well, but I'm not gonna talk about that right now. So in terms of setup, you're gonna put in two, uh, pterodactyls per player, but not yet into the bag. You still, in the two player game, we're still gonna be removing two of each species, okay? So those are out, out of the bag, and we're not gonna be using six. And the reason why they had to revise the setup rules is because they said, put it in the bag and then draw, which means you can get pterodactyls on these eggs. Uh, and you don't want to have, you only want other dinosaurs in these eggs, so that's why they revised the rules. So I'm gonna draw two. And then Julie will draw too. I have a Stegosaurus and an orange one, <laughs> which means that if I place a pterodactyl here or and here, I will get those dinosaurs in the zoo for free. So you got to lay them down. It says that. And then now we add the pterodactyls into the bag, which means we'll have an even count. So like I said, it was confusing if you got pterodactyls in the A's because then you would place and we got that the first time we played. You place a pterodactyl here, and then a pterodactyl would be born, and then you place another pterodactyl, so that's why they removed that. So let's take a look at what, how, you, how you use these boards. So you'll see that there is a number here, one. Pterodactyls must start here first. And then you have to decide, am I gonna put a pterodactyl here on two, two, or two? So you can choose which three spots here for your third, second pterodactyl. Oops, I gotta put it in camera here. <laughs> uh, and then your third pterodactyl, you can get into three, but only along the path. Uh, so if I choose this path, I'm gonna have to put another one here to get to here. So you do have to follow the path, but if I go to the left, I can choose to put a pterodactyl here or here, and then put my third pterodactyl here. So it would take three pterodactyls to get up to this spot. If I go here, here, I can't get to three because it's not along that path. I'd have to go here, 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 and here. It would take four pterodactyls to, to cover. And if I got all five, which there's only four in the game I couldn't do, but in a three, four, or five player game, you could get that many. So what does this spot say? If I, I'll have my, my extra dinosaur born when I put a pterodactyl here, this means that I'll get three points for every pterodactyl on the other, in the other zoo. So Julie has two pterodactyls, I get six points. Here, every stegosaurus is one point, I get another uh, dinosaur baby. And here, I just get seven points. So it's pretty much the same on this side of the board, except these dinosaurs will change, this dinosaur will be different here. On the other side, notice you can start either on one or one here. You decide which one you're gonna start with. And then you'll get three points for this one if you place here or here. So you either get three points or uh, a baby. And then if you want to go here, this means that every, uh, you don't, you, you ignore now the uh, dice requirements, the placement requirements if you get a third pterodactyl up here. So actually this board is probably easier to play than the other side, but we're playing this side. <laughs> because when you have a split path, that can be kind of confusing. So I would recommend maybe starting with this one. All right, so let's get playing here. So we're gonna, if you remember in a two-player game, you draw 
We're going to draw six dinosaurs each. And we're going to place three. I'm going to do this four wait, times. Wait, wait. And we're going to do this four times. And uh, then she placed 12 into our zoo. Remember, in a two player one, we're also going to be discarding three. Okay. So I have my three. Julie, you can go first. Okay. So that means I got to uh, follow the placement rules. This doesn't apply because it's a T Rex. You can't place in a pen with a T Rex, but there isn't any T Rexes on the board. Hmm. I don't know what I'm going to go for. Such a hard decision. Okay. All right, I'm placing this one. I'm getting rid of this. All right, so I'm going to go into the... That's Meg, you have to help me. What do I do now? Oh, you can you go right here into number one. That's that's what you start with for sure. So you can, now you get to place a brontosaurus. Do I take this off? Yeah, and you get to place it right away. You can put it anywhere you want. Okay. So there's a four I'm passing to Julie. She's got more brontosauruses. This is what I'm getting. Okay, now I roll. Oh, still doesn't apply. Nobody has any T-Rexes yet. So we can pretty much go anywhere we want. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'll do that. Okay, I'm placing this one. I'm getting rid of this. Oh, we're getting rid of a lot of Seriously? Well, Come on. That's the way it goes. I'm passing this. We're both going for the same thing. But I knew you were gonna I was hoping you'd pass me these two. So it really doesn't matter. Oh, that screwed me up. Ha. Huh. I have to place in the forest, so I can't put it right here. Well, that sucks. Well, I'm placing this. Well, I guess I'm gonna declare early on that I'm going for brontosauruses. Okay. So that could be a mistake. That could be. Alright, so now I'm gonna roll. Yep. Next row. And then you roll the um, dice. Yes. Okay. Wait, honey. Yeah, I'm gonna roll. It's okay. All right, you have to place in the northern part. Mm. Okay. Can I place a brontosaurus? I'm getting rid of a T-Rex. Well, you got another one? Mm-hmm. You're kicking my butt in that. I'm passing these to you. And you get, he gets those. Okay. Now you roll. Okay. Um, what is that? You can't place in a T-Rex. You can't place pen. a T-Rex. But you can place a T-Rex, yes? Yeah. If you had one. Right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm placing this. I'm getting rid of this. this. I'm basically saying I'm not going for any T Rexes. Okay. Okay, and that's what you roll, right? Yep. Okay, so. You get yellows? Yep. All right, I get this. All right, you roll. And I people? have to place on the right side. That's fine. I go here because I'm getting rid of a triceratops. I haven't gotten a pterodactyl yet. Then you're going to roll. Okay, third round. Three, six. Your turn. Okay, then. Two, four, six. Yeah, I did it right. Oh, okay. I got to roll. Mm hmm. Okay, you can't place where a T Rex is. Okay, hang on. T-Rex, I'm placing Pterodactyl to get a Stegosaurus. All right, I'm passing you this. And you get all of that. Okay. I know my hands are really shaky right now, sorry. All right, you can't place where there's a T-Rex. Yeah, right. Okay. 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 All right, I am placing this. I'm placing that. Yeah, that. Wow, you got four? Yep. I'm not doing too well. And you get, get two T-Rexes. That screws me up. Which means that I'm not going to get this. Because I'm going to have to put it in the river. Sorry. God dang it. You messed me up. All right. Go ahead and go. 
Well, if I'm going to lose those points, I might as well try to get more points where I place them. So I'm going to put them here. So this guy can't score now. That's what happens when you go for that too early. I thought that would happen. Yeah. But I'm glad I showed you that because that was not a good strategy. Two, three, four. Wait, I gotta get one more. Sorry, okay. I didn't mean to grab you like that. I apologize. You're that fine. was rude. I was being grabby. Okay, but my yellow hand stuck. Thank you. You got smaller hands. I know. I think it's because the lotion maybe it got caught or something. But okay, so okay. you roll. Now. I roll. That sucks for me. Dang it. Well. Do you want to bother? Yeah. Because I can't place it. All right. Hang on, baby. I'm sorry. I know I'm slow. I'm sorry, guys. I know I'm slow. It's okay. Okay. Right, I'm getting rid of this. You know why I got rid of that? Mm, no. Because you would have gotten it and you would have placed it. I would have get you would have went up to 18 points. I'm not going to give it to you. If I can't place it, I'm not giving it to you. Well, Here's that's what not you're nice. Getting. And this is what he's getting. All right, I roll. Yep. Okay, you can't place for the T-Rex. Okay, honey. Oh. Okay, that's fine. I'm going to get rid of this, get rid of this. this. And then I get this. So. Yep, you get another Stegosaurus. Gosh darn it. I put that like that? Yeah. Well, it doesn't matter how you put it. See, you would have gotten 24. But then you, I would have made it hard for you to choose what to go for. Yeah, I don't know. All right, here's the last two. And this is his last two. Okay, go ahead and roll. I roll? Okay. I think so trees for me which doesn't help was that was that that your... works for me i don't know honey all right well i can't place do you want to roll instead just in no, case that's okay I'm i do don't this remember and get rid of that i think it is because i no wait you rolled first right I, I yeah so i thought i could figure it out real quick oh i'm sorry honey i didn't mean to hang on you me me, you, me, you, that's three, that's you, okay, so that's me, you. You should have rolled. Okay, well, it matters for placement. Yep. All right, so you got to go into an empty. Okay. So I'm, I'm glad I figured that out. Away and I'm going to put it here. Okay. I'm sorry, sweetie. It was yeah. on my boards. I thought it was meant for no, me it's, to, it's, to do. No, it's hard to remember. It is. All right. So that mattered for me because I was able to get more points. Good, good, good. All right. So let's talk about scoring now. Okay. So here we are. All right. We'll look at my board here. I didn't get that T-Rex. I get one point for it at least. Oh, good. For having it in there. So that's one plus 15 plus one for the T-Rex. That's 16. So that's 17 plus five is 22 plus four is 20. Six. Nice. I do have the most. That's 26, 33. Uh, and I get two for every one that you have. Did I say, what was it again? 33? Yes, 33. 36, 39, because you have two. Nice. Well, what about that guy? Does he get Nothing. Points? He didn't get placed. Oh. So let me just verify. One, okay. six, 22, 26, 33, yeah, 39. Good All right. job, honey. I think you're going to beat me because you got a lot on both spots. Here you have 10, no T-Rex. Oh, you didn't get that. No. Okay, 10. Did you have the most? Yep. Or e yeah, you did, or equal to, to 17. Mm -hmm. But here is 18, it's 35. That's it. Wow. I thought you were gonna beat me. Don't I get a point for the, the no. one? Oh, no. okay. That just tells you what order you're placing. Oh, okay, I we see. We played that wrong the first time. Okay. Well, good job, sweetie. I thought you Very were going nice. to win. Well, I was trying, I was going to try and put that there, and then I would have probably won. No, but it's the same amount of points. Oh. No, I had the T-Rex, so wouldn't I have eight then? Yeah, oh, wait, so I didn't count the T-Rex, so you had 36. What did I say? 35. 
36. You only lost by three. Oh, no, I'm okay with that. It's just, remember, I had rolled, and I, I wasn't supposed to have yeah. rolled, so. so. Good job, huh? Well, it's good I figured out that I actually rolled the die because that would have been a loss of, I would have lost four points. Oh, gosh, yeah, that's a lot. So then it would have been 35 to 36. Interesting. If you would have rolled, you would have won. But all right, well, anyway. Well, I, mean, I just want to make sure we rolled the dice the right, person oh, rolled yeah. the, the dice the right time, so. Yeah, because it really matters. Uh, in yeah. that case, it did. Yeah. All right, so that's Ariel's show. Hope you guys liked it, and hope you, maybe you'll want to go out and pick it up yourself. Well, anyways, check out the review. Yes, Thank thanks, you. guys. Right, bye. bye, -bye.